obviously I, I'm embarrassed. Um, someone that is extremely, extremely private. Um, and to have one of your most intimate details, the audio heard for the entire world to hear. Um, I'm embarrassed for a number of reasons. Um, people count on Shannon, um, Shay Shay Media Club, Shay Shay Nightcap, um, ESPN. There are a lot of people that count on Shannon to be professional at all times. And I always try to be professional at all times. Um, even when I'm behind closed doors, I still try to remain a level of professional, although I'm in the privacy of my own home. Um, <clears throat> and I'm very disappointed in myself, um, not for the act. Um, I think there are millions and billions of people uh, of consenting age that engage in activities. Um, but but to have your most intimate detail on the audio to be heard, I'm disappointed in myself. I let a lot of people down. Uh, my kids, um, I reached out to them. I called them. I called my sister. Uh, my friends, obviously, my friends reached out. But, God, this was not staged. Um, came in. I threw my phone on the bed. Um Gazed in an activity. I did not know IG Live. I've never been on IG Live. I've never turned IG Live on. So I don't know how it works. And so um, all of a sudden, my other phone is going off and people are calling me FaceTime that I've never talked to a day in my life on FaceTime. And it didn't, I'm like, why are y'all calling me FaceTime? And after a while, Jamie uh, uh, Fritz, who's been my longtime marketing guy, he finally got through to me and he said, uh, Shannon, you on IG Live. I'm like, doing what? You know, I'm like, what about on IG Live for? I ain't hit no IG Live button. He says, uh, they can hear. I like, I'm like, so now, Ocho, you know, I say ask for patience. He said they can hear. And now I'm starting to get agitated again because you call me and say I'm on IG Live when I know I didn't click myself on IG Live. And he said they can hear me. I said, hear me doing what? He said, it sounds like you were having sex. Man, my heart sank. It dropped. And obviously, uh, 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 I run I run my accounts. But Jordan, being the good Samaritan, the, the good soldier that he is, Jordan, the one that cut it off. Because hell, I didn't even know it was on. Jordan cut it off. Jordan put the message up. And then after I called my agent, I called my agents, uh, the agency. I called ESPN. After I, I like, I just got this good. Tell them the truth. I said I just got to tell them the truth. My phone wasn't hacked. Uh, it wasn't an. It wasn't a prank. It was. Me being a health, healthy, active male. I mean, y'all thought I was bull jiving. Hey, hey, I'll get it in. Real talk. Hey, oh, oh Joe. See, I, I don't, man, I'll be lying. I'll lie. Former NFL star and sports commentator Shannon Sharp found himself at the center of an unexpected controversy. On a recent evening, Sharp accidentally live streamed audio of a private moment on Instagram, leading to widespread speculation and concern among his followers. Initially, Sharp claimed that his account had been hacked, a common defense in the digital age where cybersecurity threats are rampant. However, as the situation unfolded, it became clear that the incident was a result of human error rather than malicious intent. Sharp took to social media to clarify the situation, admitting that the live stream was a mistake on his part. I want to apologize to my fans and followers for the confusion and embarrassment caused by my recent Instagram live stream. Sharp stated in a heartfelt post, It was an honest mistake, and I take full responsibility for it. I am committed to maintaining the highest standards of professionalism and will ensure such incidents do not happen again. The incident has sparked a broader conversation about the importance of digital vigilance, especially for public figures who are constantly in the spotlight. Sharp's candid admission and apology have been met with a mix of empathy and criticism, highlighting the challenges of navigating personal and professional boundaries in the age of social media. Sharp, known for his outspoken and charismatic personality on shows like Undisputed, has always been a polarizing figure in the sports world. This incident, while embarrassing, has also humanized him in the eyes of many fans who appreciate his honesty and willingness to own up to his mistakes. As the dust settles, Sharp's experience serves as a reminder of the importance of being cautious and mindful in our digital interactions. In an era where a single click can lead to unintended consequences, Sharp's mishap is a lesson for all about the need for careful management of our online presence.